Howdy everyone. In this video, we're going to be comparing the Ecago coffee mug warmer to the Cosorti coffee mug warmer. Okay, so jumping right into a functions, features, and performance comparison between the Ecago and the Cosori, I think this is a real good comparison because uh, these are two very comparable products that sell for similar prices. You'll notice both of them do come with proprietary mugs that kind of hope to solve the problem that uh, a lot of regular coffee mugs have, that is they have a concave bottom so they don't conduct a lot of heat from a flat bottomed um, warmer. So the Ecago comes with a ceramic flat bottom mug, whereas the Kosori comes with a stainless steel sort of flat bottom mug, although it still has a little divot in there. So not sure why they tried to fix the problem uh, and then reintroduce it. Also, don't know about stainless steel as a mug choice. I mean, it looks nice, but it also uh, is very hot to the touch and uh, does not insulate well at all. Okay, so controls. Uh, over here on the Ecago, we do have a few options actually. First of all, we're we'll turn it on. Um, and the first thing we'll notice is there is an infrared thermometer that does a couple things. It both gives us the external temperature of the mug, currently sitting at 76. Put your hand in front of it, bumps up to 92. Uh, we can also set the uh, temperature in single degree increments, and we can switch between Celsius and Fahrenheit by long pressing both of those. Uh, also, when you pull the mug off, it knows and it turns off the heating. So notice the little heating indicator went off. So pretty cool all around, great controls on the Ecago. Over here on the Kosori, basically we turn it on and we also have single degree increments. Um, other than that, not quite, a, not quite as many options as the Kosori, but uh, still works pretty well. Uh, that said, let's jump right into a uh, performance comparison. So uh, we were gonna look at how well each of these two keeps hot water hot, starting with the Ecago. We've got water going in at 188 degrees and then cooling to 158 after an hour, losing 30 degrees when using the included mug, while our standard mug lost 49 over that same period. Compared to a non-heated mug, the Ecago plus its included mug bested that by 58 degrees, while the standard mug beat it by 39. And then we'll run the same comparison over here on the Kosori. We've got water going in at 194 degrees and then cooling to 135 when using the included mug and then going in at 185 on the standard mug and then cooling to 110 over an hour. In other words, the included mug beat the non-warmed one by 28 degrees while the standard mug beat it by just 13. All right, now starting off with the uh, standardized figure, basically that black mug in those two tests, so using the same mug on both of these, the Ecago lost 49 degrees while the Kosori lost 75, so a huge difference um, between these two, a much better performance from the Ecago. Using the proprietary mugs, the Ecago lost just 30 degrees, while the Kosori lost 60. So really, um, an overall much better performance from the Ecago. So I think in my mind, no question about it, it is the better product. Um, the Kosori just seems underpowered and doesn't have as many options as the Ecago. So I really can't see a reason to purchase this over this.